Senator Hoven says the funding of $38 million will be used to help Rainbow Energy's Coal Creek facility in Underwood. Uh, capture and store CO2, which is vitally important to the long-term future operations of the power plant. The Energy Information Administration says North Dakota contains the world's largest known deposit of lignite and is the fifth largest coal producing state in the country. Lignite Energy Council President and CEO Jason Boer says the money is important to the coal industry. It allows us to maintain our place in the market. It, it allows us to maintain that employment and it, it allows us to continue to play a role in the communities in North Dakota. Lignite Energy Council says the money will allow the Coal Creek Station to continue to put electricity into the marketplace under a broader range of circumstances. So if regulators or the federal government are saying to us, um, you can provide electricity, but it has to be under these circumstances, we're able to then meet those circumstances. We're able to say, we can sell you the electricity at a lower carbon footprint. The investment will also help protect jobs by Coal Creek and Falkirk Mine. These, these are people's lives that depend on how the research progresses. They're supporting the work every day when they're providing electricity to us as efficiently as they can. Lignite Energy feels that North Dakota has laid the foundation for this new technology and the federal government is finally making that acknowledgement with the money rewarded. It's an indication of trust that the Department of Energy has in the pathway that North Dakota has laid out. Lignite Energy Council says this demonstrates to the rest of the world that this is a viable way forward for the coal industry. I'm Justin Geck reporting for your newsletter. North Dakota has been a leader in carbon capture technologies.